I love homemade spring rolls and usually you would serve it as a little canapé and serve it with some sweet chilli sauce. But I want to show you my Vietnamese inspired salad with spring rolls. So let's get onto the dressing first. Some sweet chilli sauce into a bowl, a few tablespoons and for a little hit of saltiness, some fish sauce and acid. This is a giant lime so I probably will only need half of this. And I'm just going to use my spoon to juice this. A really nice dressing. Give that a mix. And I'll just pop that to one side while we get on to the spring rolls. So this is just some chicken mince, some shiitake mushrooms that I finely diced. For a mild onion flavour, some spring onions, again, that I finely diced. And a good hit of garlic. This one's quite big, so again, I'll just add one of them. To season this, some sweet soy or ketchup manis. I love this. It's got this really deep, dark, savoury flavour. And then to bind the whole thing together, one egg. So we'll crack that into a bowl first. A quick whisk. Now this needs to be bound quite well, so just use a fork to mash it together and then just whip it. Now it will look slightly wet, but that's okay. We do have some really sturdy spring roll wrappers that's going to hold it nicely together. Now I've just bought myself some spring roll wrappers and you can get them from all good Asian grocers. I think you can even find them in supermarkets these days. So we'll start with one. We'll add a little of our mixture and I don't want these to be really big. I want them to be quite small and dainty. So we only need about a teaspoon, a teaspoon and a half of this mixture and then we can start rolling. So we'll start by folding that over, squish it together and go all the way until you get to the two points. Fold over and then wrap until we've got a nice tight spring roll. Now to fasten it together I just like to use some corn flour and water. I'll just get a brush and then brush that there, fold it over, seam side down and that's our first perfect little spring roll done. I think I'm going to make a few more of these because I love my spring rolls. And then they go into some hot oil, 180 degrees, and we'll fry them until they're crispy and golden. really hard not to have a taste now but I will wait because I want to put the salad together and these are just little rice noodles you can see how they cluster quite a lot the trick is to get some clean scissors and just chop them up like this and it's just going to be much easier to eat I'll place a generous amount into a bowl and look you could use rice for this but traditionally the Vietnamese style salad uses these noodles and you can add many different varieties of veggies. I've got cucumber, carrot, and lots of Asian style herbs. You can add tomato to it also, some onion. Before I do add everything else, I just want to dress some of the noodles. So we've got dressing everywhere, because I love a lot of dressing. And I'll add some julienne cucumber to one side. And this is why I just adore Vietnamese food, because it's refreshing. It's light, it's spicy. Now for some coriander. We'll just pick a few sprigs, bundle together and pop to one side. Now for the spring rolls. So we'll cut them into thirds. Oh, that's a good sound. And we'll just cluster them on the other side of the bowl. One last ingredient, some peanuts, some toasted peanuts. We'll just sprinkle that on the top. This is Vietnamese street food at its best. Give it a go at home.